The overall goal of this experiment is to label lymphocytes with the intracellular fluorescent dye CFSE so that lymphocytes can be monitored for cell division by flow cytometry. This is achieved by mixing lymphocytes with CFDA-SE, which is the diacetylated form of CFSE. The two acetyl groups allow the dye to rapidly enter cells. Within lymphocytes, esterases remove the acetyl groups from the CFDA-SE, forming the CFSE form of the dye. Without the acetyl groups, CFSE becomes fluorescent and is also less membrane permeant, thus concentrating the dye within cells. The amino reactive succinamidyl side chain of CFSE then covalently couples the dye to intracellular proteins, thus making the cells almost permanently fluorescent. CFSE can be used to monitor lymphocyte division based on the sequential halving of the fluorescence intensity of daughter cells. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods such as tritiodithymidine incorporation is that individual cells can be monitored for cell division. Demonstrating the procedure will be Ben Kwa, a research fellow from my laboratory. In order to label cells, begin with freshly isolated lymphocytes from spleen or lymph nodes of mice and add a concentration of between half and 10 million cells per milliliter of culture medium supplemented with 5% heat inactivated fetal calf serum. Thoroughly resuspend the cells and carefully transfer 1 milliliter to the bottom of a fresh 10 milliliter conical tube. Lay the tube horizontally. Carefully add 110 microliters of PBS to the top of the tube in the non-wetted portion of the plastic, ensuring it does not make contact with the cell solution. Add fresh dye solution of 1.1 microliters of the...